All right, so as promised, I'm going to do the unveiling of what's inside my annual MAPS survival box giveaway. Before I open this, I'm going to run through the rules of the contest one last time. Now on this video, not the last one, on this video, you need to leave a comment below to win this box. You need to be, one, you need to be subscribed. Two, I need to know who you are. You can't just pop in, subscribe, and be like, hey, I want to win that box. That's not how it works. I need to know who you are for a reason. Why? Because you need to be an active member of the community because this box needs to go to somebody that really needs it. That's what the whole idea behind this is. I do it once a year. I might even do one again in, uh, around Thanksgiving, uh, December time. Now, you got to pay it forward. You could pay it forward to yourself if need be. If you're really getting into survival and prepping, you don't know where to start, you're short on money, whatever the case may be, that's what I put this box together for, somebody in that circumstance. Either you don't know where to start building a bug out bag or survival gear. This is really basic bug out bag type of stuff I put together. And this is a really good box I made, guys, this year. Definitely surpasses last year's box, whoever gets to win this. Now, you or you can give it away. Now, I prefer if you gave it to somebody that really needs it. That's the idea behind it. It could be your brother, sister, mother, aunt, uncle, husband, father, son, daughter, dog, cat, whoever, that is just getting into survival and prepping. You might just be, you know, I've been doing it a long time. Some people are just getting into it now, just starting out, don't know where to start. That's what this idea behind this box is. This is a, an idea behind this box is to do a good deed. So if you need it, that's fine. I, you know, if you need this box and you're just starting out, that's great. If you're hunting, you want it for yourself. If um, you've been doing this for a while, I'd prefer if you gave this to somebody that could really use it or is tight on funds. Okay, so that's that's the rules of the uh, rules of it. So you leave a comment below, you're automatically in unless you happen to say you don't want to be. But please, please, please pay pay it forward. Okay, pay the good deed forward. So let's check it out. Now, as I said, all this stuff is stuff that I purchased either specifically for this box or it's surplus stuff that I've had in the past that. I'm giving because I have extras of. So let's get started. This box is crazy. This year. First thing you're going to get, you're going to get a life straw water filter. Sorry about that. I had to uh, pause to unbox it. I only got uh, two hands, guys, and I don't have a tripod. Now, this is not life straw bad, but it's a straw type water filter. What's really cool about this one is it's camo. Check that out. You're going to get a camo personal water filter. Now, you get to go through some of the basics quick. You're gonna get a pack of T-bites, some diamond braided rope, because you always need cordage. You're gonna get some power cord, four pack of light sticks, very important. Light's always important. Now, oh, hold on, truck coming. Sorry about the constant, uh, Noise, guys, I'm outside. I just had a big truck come down the street, so I had to uh, pause it. Okay, you're also going to get a pack of compressed towels. These are really cool, good to have. You're going to get emergency poncho. A couple packs of emergency hand warmers. You're going to get a brand new folding saw. You're going to get a flashlight. You are going to get a pack of emergency food ration bars. They have a five-year shelf life. You're going to get an emergency survival tent because you got to have somewhere to sleep. You're going to get a pack of uh, anti antibacterial hand wipes, you know, hand sized hand sanitizer infused wipes. You're going to get a power cord survival bracelet. This has got a built-in fire starter. Hold on one second, guys. Got another noisy truck coming by. Where am I now? That to be a little noisy. Okay. You wouldn't be complete without a Matt's Prepping and Survival Channel sticker. You're going to get a little first aid kit. I put this together myself. Basic essential stuff that you need. This is something I had laying around. I figured I'd throw it in there. It's uh, some fire starter necklace, some power cord type stuff with a little fire flint and striker. You're going to get 
if I can get it open with one hand, okay. you're gonna get a little mini tactical pen. Now again, all this gear is brand new, all of it. Now for the real good stuff. I bought this just for this box. You guys seen me show this on the channel before. I keep one in my truck, I keep one in my bug out bag. This is a real avid shooter's tool. This is not a piece of crap. This is a good multi-tool. It's got everything from shotgun choke wrenches to pin punches to standard torques and allen sizes and uh, fill up and flathead sizes used for uh, most common firearms. You're getting that. You're also going to get this. This is a uh, little survival multi, you know, multi-tool cards. It's got a little little fish hooks and all that other stuff. I bought this just for this box. Um, you know, it's a cheap one, but it works. It's going to do the trick. Again, this box is designed for somebody starting out. Some of you see even seasoned survivors and preppers. This isn't for you. This is for somebody starting out. And you're going to get a brand new pocket knife. Now, say what you want about M48. Um, some of their knives are good, some are not. This happens to be a good one. I actually uh, carry this one. I think I actually have it on me at the moment. Let me take a look. I do. This is the knife you're going to be getting. It's a 8CR13, which is a, it's a, you know, an Asian steel, but it's a good steel, you know, a Japanese steel. It's a, but it's, it's, um, Japanese or Chinese steel, I don't remember. Chinese steel, excuse me. But it is actually a decent steel. Uh, Spyderco uses it and stuff like that. It's not horrible. Um, and it's, this is a ball bearing assisted opening knife, so you guys are getting one of these. So that's everything you're getting, guys. All right. This is one hell of a box. I mean... Look at this. This is one hell of a box you're getting. So please, please obey the rules of the challenge, the contest, whatever you want to call it. I'm going to leave this up for a week. After a week, I will do a drawing. Those of you who've been in a while know I don't do it. Not fancy, nothing crazy. I write everybody's names down, throw them all in a little bucket thing, pull a name out, boom, that's who gets it. All right, remember the rules. you got to be active in the community so I know who you are. You got to pay the good deed forward, meaning it's got to go to somebody that really needs it, whether that be yourself or somebody you know personally. All right? And you got to be subscribed. All right, everybody. That's it. Um, good luck to everybody. Have a great day.